how to connect to your Shopify with eBay. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. I bring you back with yet another video. And in this video, we're gonna be talking in great depth and detail on how you can connect a design of your choice or connect a store of your choice to eBay. And in this case, the store that we have is Shopify. So we're gonna be connecting Shopify to our eBay in the easiest, most simplest way possible. And it's gonna be really simple. So please do make sure to fully watch this video till the end to get the whole output and great depth and detail of how you're gonna allow yourself to do this. So to start things off, what you are gonna do is you're gonna to go to Shopify, okay? And you are gonna log in with an account of yours. So I'm just gonna click on login and it's gonna take me straight into the account that I wanna work with. Now, once you go into the account, from there, what we are gonna to want to do is we're gonna get straight into the design bit. So in this case, we're just gonna wait for things to load up. Here we are. Now, once we're over here, you're gonna to go to Shopify and obviously you're gonna add a sales channel in Shopify. Now, once you click on add apps, what it's gonna do is it's gonna give you the Shopify app store and we're gonna click on the Shopify app store. Now, if you write eBay in the Shopify app store, it's not gonna give you some direct app. Like if you write Amazon or something, it's gonna give you a direct, you know, drop shipping integration. But if we write eBay, look at this. It doesn't exactly give us uh, a proper app that we can use to uh, dropship on eBay. There are things like uh, Salesdio, but this is not a dropshipper. We want to connect it to eBay so we can import our eBay products. So there's no direct integration, right? So what will we do for Shopify and eBay connection, okay? So basically what it does is Shopify has told us to get eBay's inventory or to, you know, actually integrate eBay, you can real-time sync it through a few products. So the best would be CD Commerce eBay integration, which is exactly what we're gonna be doing. So once you're over here, you can see CED e-commerce. Okay, this is a new integration app that they've added for us. We're gonna click on install to actually add this app into our repertoire. So once you add this, it's gonna be really easy to you know work around with this. So I'm just gonna click on install, wait for things to load up. And here you can see it asks you to install app. You're also gonna make sure that you have an eBay account. So I obviously have an eBay account. And uh, once everything is connected, you can choose to you know add inventory from eBay's you know main store, or you can even add things from your own seller's hub into your Shopify store. So I'm just uh, gonna wait for this to load up. Then we're gonna sign up and we're gonna get things authorized and once our things are authorized from there on out everything should be a piece of cake so here we go ebay integration okay it uh, asks us welcome it asks us for a registration and for the registration obviously you're going to want to go ahead and sign in with your ebay account okay and uh, obviously as that happens uh, it's going to come here so Welcome to my store, uh, to our app. You know, there's one to four steps, prerequisites. So before you begin selling with this app, make sure you have these in place. So obviously I have a seller account over here, clearly, as you can see. Then uh, no alternate Shopify apps or sales channel. And then you're just going to agree to things and click on next. Now, once you've agreed with these things, you're going to tell them if you have a live eBay account. So obviously I have a live eBay account from the United States, so I'm gonna click on connect. And once you click on connect, it's going to uh, check the uh, eBay status. So you're gonna make sure that your eBay status is live and active. And uh, in the case that it does not take the live account, what you can do is you can choose a sandbox account. So pretty simple. And again, click on connect. And it should authorize your eBay pretty simply, pretty easily. If it again gives error, you could uh, just go into your signbox eBay. And here you can see my eBay is already signed in. So if it does an error, you could just make sure to go ahead into help and contact to get the daily deals, but you get the whole point. So you're going to connect your eBay store to your registrations. Once you do that, you're going to choose your locations, zip code and all. So let's say I'm going to choose my location, choose your zip code, enter the location. And once you've gone with the necessary things and connected everything, you're going to click on next. And once all of that is done and the sales channel for eBay is added into your store, 
From there on out, you can actually start importing your inventory. Now, you know, as I said, there's two ways to actually import inventory. You can either import things from your seller's hub in eBay, or you can import them from the actual eBay products. So from the seller's hub is because obviously, you know, the items that we're selling on eBay, we could also sell them on our Shopify store. Okay. And on the Shopify store, uh, they would practically sell better because, um, you know, people rather go and buy something from a proper store because, you know, there's Nike shoes on eBay as well, but I'd rather buy Nike shoes from Nike's actual website, right? Or there's, you know, PS4s or some Razer gaming keyboard on eBay as well, but I would rather buy them from Razer or Sony's actual website. So, you know, that's how things work with Shopify stores as well. So, yeah, you're going to make sure to uh, go ahead and uh, import your seller's hub products. Or, you know, let's say we want to go with something else. I'm going to get out of the seller's hub. And here, let's say we have uh, sneakers that we want to import. So I'm going to load the things in. And let's say there's uh, these uh, headphones as well. These Walker Razor Slim Electronic Shooting Muffs that you can add for yourself. There's uh, these things as well. So just go with whatever, you know, best suits your uh, import uh, design. What you're going to do from here is you can copy the URL of this and you're going to paste it into your CED Commerce. And once you paste it into your CED Commerce sales channel, from there on out, it's going to automatically import those products into your Shopify products over here. Okay. And you can easily find them in this section. And trust me, it's a really easy and really simple process to get your head around. It's not too difficult. And what that will allow you to do is uh, it will allow you to just really, um, you could say, uh, get a very nice, smooth, integrated working in your uh, Shopify store. Now, moving on, you can also fulfill orders using CED Commerce because obviously once you've imported products, that's fine, but you need to fulfill orders, right? So to fulfill orders, you can come over to eBay and once someone actually orders something from your store, you're going to order it from eBay and you're going to send it straight to the buyer. So you're going to act as the middleman vendor, okay? Uh, so you're going to order it from the eBay you know, warehouse you're going to let them know that, okay, so I've um, sent the order out. It's going to reach your address in 8 to 12 days or however many days it may take in shipping. But you are going to make sure that you're going to give them all the details that they're provided on eBay regarding the product. So, you know, you're going to say you're going to get a full USA warranty. And you were out of the USA, you can get a warranty. And you can give them the details of the product what the product actually has. And if they have a 60% uh, thing going on it or any type of sale, you're going to want to give that sale on your store as well, because people do tend to cross check these products. And if they see that you're, you know, leeching them off of more price, then obviously that uh, ruins the relationship with the customer. So yeah, I wouldn't recommend that. But yeah, that is basically how you are going to connect your Shopify to eBay and import products, use CED commerce and everything should be good to go. So that's pretty much about it for this video. Now, if you enjoyed watching, please do make sure to drop down a like, subscribe to the channel. And if you want to see more videos like this in the future, let me know down in the comments below and I'll make more for you. Till then, that's all from me and I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.